3-1 win against Crusaders here at Seaview today. What's your thoughts on the game? Yes, um, we were we were superb today. Um, it was a fantastic performance by everybody again. Uh, sometimes you just have to pinch yourself, you know, after that today. But it's not too often you'll ever come to Seaview and come away deserved winners. And I thought we were deserved winners today. Some of the chances we created, especially on the, the counter-attack. And this is what... I've been saying for a long time, you know, it's about getting the, the top end of the pitch, having a threat, having pace, and pace hurts. I'm a great believer in that. We're finally now in JJ and in Cather and in, in, uh, Gawney and, and Johnny. We've got a real threat in the in the last third. So if we can defend well and do well, but we're playing through, we're playing through the middle now, which really we've encouraged Daniel and Kyle to stay on the ball, drive with the ball, get it in the IS feet and try and link play, and, and that's working at the minute. And, but I think also whenever you come here you have to defend well and our back three and our goalkeeper and our two wing backs were superb today to a man and you know I, I thought it was a, a real fantastic team performance round. Only one change from the starting side that it started on Tuesday, Johnny Fraser coming in and, and what a difference he made going forward. But I thought Johnny looked really sharp in the two previous games and I just thought JJ hasn't had a lot of, of game time. Um, this season, we've asked him to play three games in the bounce and he's done really well. But I thought today was, was Johnny's day and, and as I say, coming off the bench he had been really, really sharp and good and a real threat and I just fancied him to do well today against uh, with his pace and stressing him in behind. Um, I know coming to save you, you're obviously having to contend with a lot of long balls. The finish scoring early in the game was, was difficult for us, but we showed that we were absolute defensively. Yeah, I think I think well, we, uh, we sat off in the first 10-15 minutes, which, which I'm sure you can hear me on the sidelines. Uh, we try, we try to be positive and close the gaps. And but whenever we bring our two wing backs in, defending a five and let them play in front of us, it was going to be a long day. So we encouraged the boys to to get the press higher. We asked Johnny and and uh, Cather and, and Big Yaya to press them higher up the pitch so we could close the gaps. And and we've done that. We look we look for better for it. You know, uh, obviously whenever it the, the broke down from Crusaders. We were able to pick up the ball, second ball, and we were able to control the breakaways. And, and I thought that it worked really, really well today. But you, you're nothing without without bravery. Uh, and, and the boys were brave when we had the ball today. They played in tight areas. Passing was fantastic. Phases and transfer, you know, it was just all really on. on and we carried a massive threat. And, and, and we looked dangerous at all times today. And last week before our next game now, we're about to go on Avon on Tuesday night. It'll be another difficult away fixture at Monty Park. Yeah, Glen Avon on their day is top team. So, uh, but I think we've we've got good confidence now. We've had three, maybe maybe more. And it's not just about picking up points against Dungan, picking up points against Linfield, and picking up points today against the crew. We played really well against Coleraine, got nothing. We played really well against the Glens too, and got nothing. So, this is football. You know what? What we do have now is we'll have a wee bit of confidence, and we'll have a real threat at the end of the pitch. And I think if we can continue as is then we'll carry a threat the rest of the season. It's very important now we, we do the same again, check the boys, let them rest up. There's a few sore bodies in there, but a heroic performance today from, from the players and a special mention to, as well to our, our, our guys that's not in the team at the minute. Their attitudes have been fantastic. Keelan came on today, done really well. His attitude's been super. Uh, and that goes for everybody who's coming off the bench. And I know it's frustrating with them not playing, but they have a massive part to play the rest of the season. You can see it's going to be really tight going Tuesday to Saturday, Tuesday. So we're going to need them all. And at the minute, all, all everybody's pulling in the same direction, and, and that, that makes for good a good side. Well done, Thank you, Ryan. Okay, Pixel.